Hey everybody, I am coming to talk to y'all today about why you want to keep primer and finishing spray in your makeup kit. I'm Brandi Thompson and I am a beauty guide with Blind Life by Alcone and if you don't know me, um, let me know that you this is your first time catching this video, uh, me on video and if you do, hi, how are you doing? I'm still um, not home yet from my trip. so. We are at my in-laws house and <clears throat> I found the best lighting I could find to show you what I was gonna show you. That's one reason I haven't been doing much makeup videos is because the lighting's not bad for doing my makeup, but it doesn't come across the camera at all very well. Okay, so um, we're getting ready to go do some fun evening stuff in the And there goes the camera. Regular scheduled programming will be fun back to normal. Okay, so what I'm going to show you, hopefully, without any more distractions, um, make sure this is, I think there's a little piece of the camera getting covered, but, so, first of all, I wanted to tell you, and I'll talk to you about these while I'm doing it, so that you can, um, see, so this is, a uh, first base primer spray, hmm, can we focus? And it comes in, this is a two ounce bottle, I believe it also comes in a four ounce bottle, so, um, one bottle lasts forever. This is the two ounce and I got it because I knew I'd be traveling and stuff and it was, um, it's lasted me a really long time already. So some of the things about it, I'm gonna go ahead and spray one. Maybe this isn't gonna work. I don't know why it's not sticking. Um, maybe that'll help. Yeah, you didn't see me do that, did you? All right, we're gonna try again. All right, keep going. Okay, so I'm gonna spray one side, and this is a fine mist, and this is the time setter, and that's not what I want. I want my first base. So I'm gonna just spray here. As you can see, I just spray it on my arm. Now, on this arm, there will be no spray, and what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna swatch a couple of eyeshadows, and then um, we're gonna see the difference in how they show up, because some of the properties of the first base primer spray is it improves makeup application so just make sure it gives a nice uh, smooth uh, canvas for your makeup to go on it reduces the appearance of large pores and um, prevents the makeup from setting into fine lines and wrinkles so here's a fact I have some fine lines have a few wrinkles but my makeup sitting on top of it instead of sinking down into it because I used my primer spray so it doesn't accentuate <laughs> It doesn't make them go away, but it doesn't make them show up more either. Now you guys are just going to have to stick around and see how many more times it falls before this is over because I'm sure that wasn't the last one. You're about to have to find something different to do. Um, <laughs> one more time. Okay, so I've got my primer spray on. Um, I was just going to tell you about it. It um, keeps your makeup more vibrant throughout the day. So I'm going to use this blue here. So that's what's on my finger. And I'm just going to swatch here. Then this purple, and I'm doing this like you can see what I'm doing. Um, then I'm going to go here, and then this brown, I'm going to go here. And I'm going to do the same thing on the other side. So this has no spray, and they're just going to, same. Boom. Purple. Boom. Brown. So, I don't know if you can tell a difference. I didn't put them in a good spot for that. If you can tell a difference in the... I feel like this definitely looks more vibrant. But, I'm supposed to believe that, right? What do y'all think? Okay, and then the second piece of this is the um, setting spray. So the setting spray, I might even love it. I love them both. Um, I have another demo I want to do with the primer spray when I get back home with an orange and I'm going to show y'all what the difference it makes when you use it and don't use it. So stay tuned for that. That'll be part of my 100 days of life. Okay. So, something different. Let's try this. Okay. I'm just going to move right here. You can still see. Right? Doop, doop, doop. Okay. So I have my setting spray. So I'm going to go ahead and throw on the setting spray, time setter, matte finish, or makeup finish, it's oil-free setting spray. And I'm gonna throw it on here. 
Okay, you don't need a lot. Those just like half squirts. I'm gonna let that dry. And I didn't put anything on this side, right? Um, so the setting spray is oil free. It prevents also from settling into your fine lines and wrinkles. It gives you a youthful, professional, just matte look. It extends the wear of your makeup and prevents transfer. And one of the cool things about it, I think, and the same goes for the primer spray. Alcone has been around for a long time and they've been suppliers to professional makeup artists for the stars, for celebrities, for all kinds of makeup artists that do um, professional work, right? Um, and so at trade shows, they would sell this and it was one of the uh, best selling items at their trade shows and it's very well known by uh, professional makeup artists. So that's just a fun fact. So if you have it, then you're using something that is loved by professional makeup artists. Okay, so I'm gonna show you the side first. So we have primer and setting spray. And we have a little transfer, but it's still there, right? So this has nothing, and it looks like that whenever you wipe it. Seriously, the difference. Same amount of pressure on both sides. And that's why I like my setting spray and my primer, because it makes it stay. Again, I'm going to show you one more time. Primary setting spray, no primer, no setting spray. The proof is in the pudding. So let me know when you want to get yours, and I will, or if you just want to go to brandy tcom and get it right now. There's two sizes, um, and it'll make a difference in how your makeup stays on all summer long. Thanks for joining me, you guys. Have a great night. Love y'all. Bye.